it's always when you're not filming that you end up finding some of your best stuff. There we go. That's a cracker of a deck, that. Really nice. Nice amount of matrix. Could do something half decent with that. That's definitely going in the bag. Get in. Might even be a Zugo. Zugo uh, Bronaeus. I can't remember the name of the species, but yeah, nice bit of colour on that. Easy going in the bag. Morning. Me and Liam are at uh, Port Mulgrave today. See what's what. It's never that great here anymore compared to what five or six, five years ago when I was coming and used to bag everything up constantly with heavy bags all day. So let's see what we can find. Hopefully, some bits. Let's go. Look at this first find of the day. Look at that, you can see the keel ribbon. Nice dack to start off my day. Not bad at all that. Hopefully more's gonna wash out of this cliff here. Used to be a lot that came out of here many years ago. Hopefully it's time for more. You just spotted this one here. <coughs> Is, there Is there anything? Yeah, there we go. Whether that's in good nick or not, I couldn't tell you so. We'll have to hit that in a bit and uh, and see if it's any good. If not, stay on the beach for as far as I'm concerned. But it'll go in the bag for now. So I've just spotted uh, this nodule right here. It's a nice big size. This is your typical Hildoceros uh, nodule that they come in. So I'll get my big hammer out and we'll give that a hit. Hopefully there'll be something in there. It'd be nice. It'd be very nice. Big six inch hildy, it'd be great. No easy way to hit that one. So nothing in there yet. No, looks like it's gonna be an empty. Yeah, nothing. Rubbish. This is the type of keen eye that you need to spot stuff. That wouldn't look like anything, but I've noticed right there is a keel. Oh, that's bust as hell, that is. My days. Gone. <laughs> Win some, you lose some. Damn. And sometimes you don't even know that they're there. I just kick this one, and look at that. Get out of the dark. There we go. Look at that, nice little duck showing, beautiful, didn't actually see that, kicked it, rolled in front of me, get in. Here we go, oh, that should split quite well I think, keel's all there, the inner wheel's there, a little worn light but it's always worth a tap and see if it'll split well, I'll get a tap now and let's see. Not looking promising, I must admit. But we'll have a go anyway, because why not? Split on the other side. <laughs> it's not going to split well, this at all. But hey ho. Ooh. Is it going to go? No, it's gone around the other side. Ah, rubbish. Ended up being crap. Oh well. Here we go, just spotted this one. And if you want to have Dax, just come to Port Mulgrave. Oh, so there we go. It's not a terrible one, there is a crack though running around there. Was one there at some point. Oh, that's just a cut. No, that's a Dax, that would have been a Dax. So yeah, stick that in the bag, I'll prep that up at some point. It's not a terrible one, that one. Not a terrible find at all. And then just as I turn my camera off that, I notice over here uh, is another deck. Still got that one in my hand, look. Literally looked over my shoulder and there it is. There's a couple decent ones. Happy days. 
Well, the whole purpose of this trip up this week was just to get a load of DAX ready for the website and... Uh, it's a bit of a scuffed up one, but I can make a smaller one out of that. Straight out of a cliff fall. Lovely. Right next to that one. Oh, this could be a good one. Oh, it's a bit worn. But... There's a duck there, and that's a nice size nodule. There's every chance that, well, more than likely, a good chance that there's more in there. So that one's going in the bag too. Flipping it. I've got my duck blinkers on today, guys. Duck blinkers, get in. Here we go, once again. <laughs> Sorry if you all wanted to see something different, but Port Mulgrave is just duck city. There's one. Whether the middle's there or not is another question, but it'll go in the bag regardless. We'll prep it up. This side might be better than that side. Usually if it's indented around here with shale, but it might be bad, but we'll see. Either way, can't beat you fossil collecting and you can't beat ammonites for me. So I was just about to start saying that this is one of my, used to be one of my favorite spots to go collecting in my nice double hildy that I've got, that I found in this section. Just spotted a couple of other really nice bits. One really nice bit that I've not had in a while, so I'll show you that now. So here we go, moment of truth, I've not turned this over yet. But that is a hildy. Oh, it's a good hildy. It's a really, really good hildy. Nice size too, about four inches. Might be something on the back there. I have to prep that to find out, but that makes my day. And then right behind this, that looks like a dac. Oh, yep, get in. Just as I was about to say, this was one of my favorite spots. Can't beat this, can't beat it. And once again, Harpo Dan strikes again. He's gluing back as always, but look at that baby. Another Harposaurus. Tell you, I'm on a roll at the minute with these bloody things. I'm a harpy boy in a harpy world. <laughs> oh, this is a good day, not bad at all. And just a quick one. The, ooh, oh, let me get in some shade. Yeah, there was better, that's better. Uploaded the, uploaded an absolute ton of stuff to the website now. Some really high quality material in there. I suggest you go buy it soon because it's gonna sell out pretty quick, they usually do. Put about 30 or 40 things on. Once they're gone, I've got more material to upload that's ready in the wings. I'm going full hog with this soon. I've decided, right, I better move away because up there sounds like it's gonna fall, right? Subscribe to me! There's a really nice uh, pyritic harposaurus just wearing out of the bedrock. Pyrite's taken over that. Just so you know, in case people don't know, and I've said it before a million times, you cannot dig in this stuff. This is what is called in situ. Do not touch the bedrock. Anything that falls out of them cliffs, and it's all around here, if it's loose, it's yours. If it's in there, or in the cliffs, it's not yours. Don't take it. Don't dig out. You'll hurt yourself and the cliffs will drop on you and probably kill you. Not good. That looks like a damn fresh nodule, that does. Oh, oh way. Oh, there's a keel there. Is there any others? Oh, there. Bit lighter, there we go. So that's a double. That's fresh out of the cliff, that. The nice rusty looking nodules, they usually prepare really nice. Cracking stuff. Wasn't expecting as good a day as I'm having. Very strange.